Swan security cameras offer two primary mobile apps for managing your video recordings. You can delete videos using either Swan View Link or Swan View Plus. Once you have opened your Swan security app, the first step is to navigate to the recording section. Look for either playback or recordings in your app menu. Next, you need to select the specific date and time range for the videos you want to delete. The app will display a calendar or timeline interface where you can choose your desired time period. After selecting your time range, choose the specific video files or camera channels you want to delete. You can select individual recordings or multiple files at once for batch deletion. Once you have selected your videos, look for the delete or trash icon. Tap this icon to initiate the deletion process. The app will prompt you to confirm your decision before permanently removing the files. Important note, when you delete videos through the mobile app, you are typically removing files from cloud storage. Your local DVR storage may still contain these recordings and require separate deletion. The Swan security apps also support batch deletion, allowing you to select and delete multiple video files simultaneously. This feature saves time when managing large amounts of recorded footage. Besides using the mobile app, you can delete videos directly from your Swan DVR or NVR using two primary methods. This gives you more control and access to advanced deletion options. There are two main approaches, using the DVR interface directly with a mouse or remote control, or accessing the system through a web browser using the device's IP address. Method one involves accessing your DVR's main menu directly. You'll see an interface like this with various operation options, including search and playback functions. The DVR interface method follows five key steps. First, access the main menu using your mouse or remote control. Then navigate to the search or playback menu where you can browse your recordings. Next, select your desired date range and camera channels to filter the recordings. Highlight the specific recordings you want to delete then right-click to access the context menu. Finally, select the Delete option and confirm the action with your administrator password. This ensures only authorized users can remove recordings. Method two uses web browser access. You'll connect to your DVR's IP address and see a login screen like this, where you'll enter your administrator credentials. The web browser method also follows five steps. Start by opening your web browser and entering your DVR's IP address then log in using your administrator username and password. Once logged in, navigate to the recording management section of the web interface. Here you can browse and select the specific video files you want to delete. Finally, execute the deletion command through the web interface. This method provides a user-friendly way to manage recordings remotely. Both deletion methods require administrator level access to ensure security. This prevents unauthorized users from removing important recordings from your system. Remember that deletions are permanent with no recovery option. Once you delete recordings, they cannot be restored, so always double check before confirming. Most systems will show a confirmation dialog like this one before completing the deletion. Always review what you're deleting and confirm you have the correct files selected. Direct DVR and NVR access provides powerful video management capabilities, but always use these deletion methods responsibly and maintain proper security protocols.